Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Well, Tracy, where else would I be? <laughs> so I want to say good afternoon to Reverend, Reverend Dr. Kenneth Mitchum, uh, Mayor Taylor, Councilman Gomez. Thank you all our postal colleagues, also ladies and gentlemen. I'm pleased to be here, as Tracy mentioned, uh, representing 14,000 hardworking postal employees in northern New Jersey. And I will say, just add a little ad lib here, and most of us carry the mail, too. <laughs> I remember the days. In fact, I was just mentioning to, uh, to the Reverend, uh, it's days like this that I worry about my carriers, cold and winter, right? Anyway, you know, we believe in our staff program. It's a great opportunity to connect with our customers in a very personal and inspiring way, as I think you all agree with this stamp dedication. Today we're here to, to unveil the oversized enlargement of the latest stamp in the United States Postal Service's Black Heritage Series and part of East Orange's Black History Month celebration. And I will have to say, as we stated before, it's not only black history, it's American history. It's world history. And it is our history. So since 1978, the Postal Service's Black History Stamp Series has remained amongst the most popular, highly anticipated of the United States Postal Service's commemorative stamp series. This year is no exception. There's a common thread as you study the history of the 39 honorees in this distinguished series of stamps and their contributions to this nation that encompasses many fields, including entertainment and education, covering the whole gamut. Each honor delivered a legacy famed in determination and leadership, community service, and quite often, faith. Those attributes elevated the levels of their achievements, and each of the stories of these great Americans bears remembering during Black History Month and beyond. That certainly can be said of Bishop Richard Allen. His life story still inspires us to this day. And speaking of inspiration, it's interesting to note that both Fred Frederick Douglass and Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. said that they were influenced by how Bishop Allen seemed to channel a higher power to work through him and shepherd African Americans during some of this country's darkest days. The commemorative stamp that we will dedicate today celebrates the history, the moments, and the movements that Bishop Allen inspired and embodied. The stamp image fe features a portrait of Bishop Allen extracted from an 1876 print titled Bishops of the AME Church. The original print from the Library Co uh, Company of Philadelphia featured Bishop Allen in the center surrounded by 10 other bishops. As proud employees of the United States Postal Service, we are honored to be here in East Orange to celebrate Black History Month and to recognize Bishop Allen's first class achievements of a life dedicated to service and commitment to his fellow man. Shortly, anticipation building here, but shortly we will unveil uh, an enlargement of the new Richard Allen Forever stamp. Again, as Betty said, it's forever. Not only forever, forever that we, you, you can utilize it forever, but it's also in our, in our hearts and our minds forever. Uh, may the legacy of Richard Allen and the new stamp bearing his image inspire new generations to embrace a positive spirit of hope, perseverance, and community service. I would like to call the members of the dais and our special guest to join me in unveiling this enlargement of the new Richard Allen Forever Commemorative Stamp. So please join me. <laughs> 